Thank you for being with us. Our top story tonight, doctors say Pope Francis is recovering well from yesterday's hernia surgery. The Holy Father spent a quiet night managing to rest for a long time and this morning was in good condition. EWTN Vatican Bureau Chief Andreas Tonhauser has more. Pope Francis is doing fine. After the unsettling news yesterday that the Holy Father has again been admitted to the Gemelli Clinic, it's just 20 minutes away here from St. Peter's Square, Everyone here is relieved that the pontiff seems to have coped well with the operation he had to undergo yesterday. Vatican spokesperson Matteo Bruni confirmed in a communique today that Pope Francis has spent a quiet night at the hospital and was able to get a lot of rest. The first routine checkups after the operation would all be positive, said Bruni. This is in line with what the surgeon told media representatives yesterday directly after the operation. The intervention lasted two hours from 4 to 6 p.m. Rome time. Pope Francis had a so-called laparotomy, which means his abdomen was opened and later reconstructed with prosthetic material. While the Vatican communicated that it was an operation that had been planned in the days before, it was still not an easy surgery especially considering Pope Francis's general health issues and his age. He had said before that his last full anesthesia two years ago had not been easy for him to cope with. This time around, we're being told that things have gone better. The spokesperson asked everyone to keep Pope Francis in their prayers. So far, the Holy Father is expected to stay at the hospital for the next nine days to get enough rest. All appointments until the 18th of June were canceled. However, all apostolic trips, including the one to the World Youth Day in August in Lisbon, are said to still be happening. In Rome, Andreas Tonhauser, EWTN News Nightly.